What's up guys, Felix the Creator here. In this quick tip tutorial, I will show you how you can rotate a video in Adobe Premiere Pro and how you can recreate this cool spinning rotating camera effect in post. Probably you know this effect from different music videos and some really cool Hollywood shots where the camera is spinning in slow motion or it's rotating really smooth, often with a zoom in a picture. I really love this effect and so I've tried to recreate this one in Premiere Pro. For the best results I would recommend a picture that is shot with a wide angle and this effect is working well with a picture that has a horizontal line like this here. If you see this effect in any kind of music video or in some Hollywood blockbusters, for sure they are working with some awesome camera rigs where the camera can spin with a roboter arm or something like this. Before we start to recreate this effect, make sure to hit the subscribe button so you won't miss any upcoming videos. Okay, we are working with this shot here. This is some stock footage from Artgrid.io by the way. We want to start here at the beginning. Go to the effect controls on the left side, go to the rotation and set the first keyframe here with this timer icon here on the left side and bring this to 180 degrees. Now choose the timing or duration where you want to apply this effect. Yeah, let's say something like this and bring the rotation back to zero. And for sure you can see it here the picture is out of the frame. So what we have to do is to scale up the picture. Scroll along here on your clip and you can see you have some more black here out of the frame. So scale it up a bit. Okay, something like 205. Okay, it's working fine, but we want to bring this to the next level and create an outstanding rotation with a little zoom in effect. Therefore you have to bring the cursor here at the end, so to the last keyframe, scale it a bit more up so that we have more possibilities to play around with this picture. Let's say we bring this up to 230. Now set a keyframe here at the end. Click on this timer icon. Go to the start of this clip and scale it down to, let's say to 190. And now scroll through your timeline and check out if you have any cropping problems. Yeah, you can see it here in this corner and on that right corner here on the bottom. To fix that, you have to adjust the scaling number. So bring the 190, maybe to 195. Again, scroll through your timeline and check if you have any cropping problems. Okay, it looks good. Another thing we want to change is the end position of this clip. Bring your cursor to the start position, set a keyframe here from the position. So we want to start at this point. Go to the end. and change the framing. So something like this, yeah, that looks really good. And as you can see, Premiere Pro set automatically a keyframe if you change any position here. Again, scroll through your timeline and check out if there is any issues with the cropping. Okay, this looks really good. Now we have recreated this cool spinning camera rotating effect with a little zoom into the picture. Another extra tip. Of course it works really good if you have some 4K footage and you edit in a HD sequence as an example. In this case you have much more pixels. This means that you have more possibilities to zoom in and zoom out. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you like to recreate some cool music video effects, have a look at one of my latest tutorials about a popular music video effect. Check this out and see you soon, Felix the Creator.